Hey everybody, one of Wisdom here. It's uh, January 27th, about 7 p.m. Uh, long time no record. Of course, you're completely unaware what happened to me. It was a Weapon Master glitch. It's exclusive to Wii. If you don't proceed straight into Chapter 21 from Chapter 20, the Weapon Master goes into eternal slumber. Uh, unlike what myself and many others thought, it doesn't have anything to do with bombing in the hole. It's just make sure that you have time set aside to go straight into 21 uh, and again it does seem to be Wii specific so subsequently what I've had to do is come in and start a new save file which you can see here it's actually save file 4 uh, gonna do a couple of things here I, number one I have a crud ton of upgrades I need to do I actually haven't recorded any of those uh, on the new save file I've been playing through just stock characters or basic upgrades that I'd already recorded uh, First thing I'm going to do, I don't know if it's going to work, I think it, in theory it should, I've never tried it with a triple pack, uh, we'll see what happens here. Okay, so, I'm going to skip this, I don't really care about it, I've seen it before, and we're not going to do that. This is even more serious than I, yes! Yes, perhaps you're right. Okay, so as you can see, new heroic challenge is available, and we've got two magic Skylanders, which is actually wrong. This would be like the fifth magic Skylander. Uh, in this save file, I think what I did, the first one that I transferred over, which I'll show you how to do, was actually Wrecking Ball, simply because I'd barely used him, I wasn't afraid of losing any progress. Uh, Double Trouble is one of the characters from Wave 3. Uh, first impression, he's a little slow, but he still looks awesome. Uh, other Wave 3 characters are, of course, going to be Cinder. And then Slam Bam, which you can only get with the Empire of Ice Adventure Pack. It'll be Chapter 23. Uh, they are insanely hard to come by, uh, at least for people that work or go to school. Uh, you know, if you're one of the people that just wakes up in the morning and goes and pirates everything from GameStop and Walmart, and then puts it on eBay and Amazon, I guess your life is pretty good right now. Uh, what I would suggest to everybody trying to get these is do not pay the money that they want for the characters. It's absolutely ridiculous. Uh, if you could find Double Trouble, you'd be looking at $7.96 at Walmart. Uh, you know, don't pay $40 for them. Uh, same with the Empire of Ice. Uh, there's really no way to pre-order it. You know, Walmart did it for a while. Sometimes you can catch them on GameStop. I've had a few friends that have actually picked them up reasonably priced off of eBay. Uh, by reasonably, I'm talking like 30 bucks. But uh, that's basically where we're at with that. I have yet to see a Cinder. I talked to a manager at GameStop. He said there was one that he's seen. You know, and of course, that's his job. Uh, Double Trouble, he said he'd seen a few in single packs. Uh, I've yet to see that personally myself. Empire of Ice, I have never seen or I would have. Uh, but what I have, I've not... You probably wonder why I haven't unboxed Double Trouble and I'm playing him. What I actually did, the triple pack that never should have been, uh, which is Whirlwind Double Trouble Drill Sergeant, I picked up the other night. I actually found something new. Uh, that's all I found, by the way. And uh, just because I'd had such a bad you know, luck and hard time finding Double Trouble in a solo pack. Went ahead and picked it up. I'm still at the point where I don't really want to open it. I'd like to find him in a triple pack. I mean a single pack. Uh, I don't know if that'll happen, but the good news is, you know, I wasn't sure if it would overlap with Whirlwind or something, but uh, the portal would actually register Double Trouble from the unopened package, so you know, that's what I'm doing here now. Uh, there's a chance I may unwrap it. I don't really know for sure. But uh, I'll do a couple of different things here, most notably his heroic challenge. Uh, this pack should not be here in the U.S. Whirlwind was labeled an exclusive character, uh, only available at Target. Drill Sergeant was available only at Sam's Club or Walmart. Uh, everyone knows how much trouble I had finding Drill Sergeant. Quite a few of you had the same issues for the majority of people. It seemed like Whirlwind was a hard one to come by. Uh, that's why, you know, the last couple of weeks, you know, 
Portal, Portal Wind Drill Sergeant, you know, we're bringing crazy money, eBay and Amazon. Uh, now, in addition to this triple pack, they've decided to, you know, release to the general public with double trouble of all people. Uh, they're offering Whirlwind and Drill Sergeant in single packs that you can pick up at Best Buy, Walmart, Target, GameStop. Uh, and basically what that is, is it's a deceptive trade practice. Uh, they've misrepresented the product. Uh, you know, I know they didn't need to sell them overseas. They could have done them exclusive there. They could have just stuck to their guns in the U.S., you know, with Whirlwind and Drill Sergeant. But for people like myself who were loyal to the game, picked it up early on before the rush, uh, it's basically just a giant slap in the face. I did a blog post about it if anyone's bored. Uh, I generally try to keep things positive and upbeat on the blog, but I mean, this is one of those deals that was just so incredibly stupid on the part of Activision. Uh, yeah, I should probably come in there and link to the uh, you know, act I'm talking about. It's Section 5. And basically, when you read that and you look at what Activision and Toys for Bob has done with Whirlwind and Drill Sergeant, you'll see that it falls in that category. Uh, you know, for example, if I was offering gum and limited edition of 500, and that drove the price up, and people were willing to pay it, and I was selling it, I can't control the black market. I don't hold that against Activision, even though it's absolutely ridiculous, and in part due to their own ignorance of their product, uh, they're missing out on sales that are going on the black market. Uh, I won't hold that against them. You know, I do think they could do a much better job just in the course of everyday business, including tech support, which is another story. But uh, the bottom line here, it's just, you know, they kind of did the cowardly thing in my gum that would be 500 pack limited run, uh, you know, available only at Target. And then all of a sudden my limited run gum isn't limited anymore. It's got the same stats and it says one of 500, but it's actually packed 3,568. Uh, if you bought pack 1 through 500, you would be a little bit ticked off, and you could possibly make a class action lawsuit against me and my gun. Uh, you know, I know most people are just going to cuss Activision. I just kind of want to put the book in front of their face and let them know that there are certain things you need to do when you run a business, and I'm not quite sure they understand that. Uh, They've managed to keep the hype going in part, like I said, because of their own ignorance. Uh, but this is actually, it, it's the textbook definition, you know, of deceptive trade practice, misrepresenting your product. But, you know, I, I could go on and on, literally, but I've wasted six and a half minutes of your time. Uh, I'll go ahead and proceed. You can see Double Trouble, he actually looks pretty awesome. As we said, he kind of floats. Uh, his primary attack right now, you can kind of see there, it's just basically a little orb down. Okay, um, that's a secondary attack. I guess he just kind of so like conjures up a little tiki huh? statue or something. Well, let me warn you right off the uh, bat. Tough. I'm sure later on, it's kind of like Sonic Boom's hatchlings. You know, she can get them to roar and fly. I assume the same thing will happen. But, uh... That's pretty much it, you know, right out of the box with Double Trouble. Hey, everybody want a wisdom here? This is essentially part 63A of my Skylander Spirals Adventure uh, blind playthrough. Uh, I recorded part 63, it was a rant, and it took about three tries in on Double Trouble's heroic challenge. Sadly, there was a really bad audio lag. Basically, you heard heroic challenge failure about 18, 20 seconds prior to seeing that happen on the actual recording. Uh, so that's a bit of an issue, I decided to re-record it for you. Uh, I do want to point out, save game one, I had commented several times how weird I thought it was that I was so close to battling Chaos and beating him and only 45% complete, you know, not even halfway there, uh, knowing that there were only the two adventure packs out, which I had done, and I uh, assumed it must have had to be heroic challenges. If you note, know, save file four which is my second save file uh, to make up for the Weapon Master glitch is already 48% complete. Uh, as you can see, I've only got two Skylanders in there, I haven't switched them over. Uh, so yeah, I don't know, maybe that save file was doomed from the start. I don't really know, but nonetheless. I think what I'm going to do is take the rant part I had against Activision. I actually want people to see that. Uh, and go ahead 
and edit that out because there's really no issues with the audio lag. Let me skip all this. Oh. And I think what I'll do... Oh, there's a fairy forest. <laughs> what I will do is keep that and then edit this in. What I'm doing now is looking for Kali. Uh, which double trouble. You know, like I said in that part that I'll edit in, he's still in the package. I'm just playing through it. I guess he kind of hums after a while. Back for more training, eh? Well, step right up then. So he's technically my fifth magic element, but you know, it's only two. I've got him in a wrecking ball, so. I didn't see. There's two here. So 20 of 32, you break it, you buy it. Hit trolls, not paintings. Uh, also, don't want to hit vases, you lose time. I think five seconds apiece. This is tough, reward speed. Uh, the reward was plus eight speed, which should help him out here. Uh, hopefully, we can get this done fairly quickly uh, with the improved speed. So. Help! These ugly trolls have stolen our most valuable works of art. Admittedly, they're pretty weird works of art, but still. You must take out all the troll guards, and whatever you do, don't hit any of the paintings. Frankly, I'd stay away from the vases, too, but definitely not the paintings. Three, two, one. Alright, so uh, basically you've got three minutes to kill uh, 40 trolls. And you don't want to hit the paintings, and the vases will just cost you time, so ideally you don't hit those either. Uh, you also, if at all possible, which I'm about to do, that's why I took the hit, I'm trying not to level up by vases. Uh, when I recorded this the first time, I went from level 1 to level 2, and I was like surrounded by like 5 vases. Uh, needless to say, I did not complete it in time, I was about 10 seconds short. So, I really, it was just Friday night that I did this, I kind of can't remember which way I went. And there's also a glare in my room because I'm actually recording in the daytime. Uh, so I may have to adjust the <laughs> But I feel like I'm not going to the same order I did previously. I thought that was a painting, I guess it was just a vase. But anyway. You, know, like, you can't really avoid it, but I mean, if you have an option of taking some damage and not doing that, it's probably worth looking into. <laughs> uh, I think now we've got to go... I really, it's, it's kind of hard for me to see the TV right now. <laughs> Believe it or not. Um, I don't think we'll make it this time. A lot of it has to do with the shadow is really bad. It's kind of dark on the game anyway. But then whenever you're actually going through, uh, there's the glare on the TV. It makes it One minute extremely remaining. hard to see. It really hadn't done too bad. It's just I don't know that I went the best way. But again, double trouble right out of the box. No upgrades. He's got the plus eight speed. to destroy trolls, not paintings. Damage one more painting, and you will fail this challenge. Okay, I did not see the painting. It looked like it was miles away from us. But again, it could be the glare on the TV, which you know you don't have when you watch the video. You've it's almost made it. Kind of a pain. I'll just tell you right now. I don't think we'll make it. That's why I went for those points. It'll be pretty close. But, uh, I can see us maybe getting like 35 for sure. If the trolls would actually come to me, uh, it'd be great. Is that a pain? 10 seconds remaining. That's really gonna suck if we don't get it. One heroic challenge wow. Excellent uh, job. Okay. So the plus 8 speed paid off. I think we did it with like 2 seconds. So maybe less than that. But first try, uh, granted it's like the fourth try because it took three the first time, but 
Like I said, the bad audio lag, I just went ahead and re-recorded it for you. Way to go! You just aced one top heroic challenge. Now, not only will you get some extra power, but also my own personal thumbs up. And with that, we re-wrap up Double Trouble's Heroic Challenge and my last candy cane from Christmas. So, uh, bittersweet, I suppose. <laughs> we'll come back. I may actually have to take the headset off and pull the blinds. It's uh, kind of bad. Skylands is growing Let me dark, skip young this. Portal master. Y'all have seen all that in the original playthrough. Uh, one second. Talk to Dick the Malkin. Okay, uh, I can't really edit that out, it just gets screwy when you do that, but uh, I can see now because the blinds are pulled, so should have done it beforehand, but whatever. Uh, for those of you, I'm not sure what parts I'll pull from that rant against Activision when I introduce Double Trouble, but here's a good look at him. Uh, 360, he is a little quicker after his heroic challenge, which like I said is plus 8 speed. A button, that is his primary attack. Uh, you can actually hold it, which is pretty sweet. I did not know that. So, I'm not sure when you'd ever have to do that, but you can hold it, you know, and make circles, which would be very handy if you're surrounded by enemies. Particularly if you don't have vases or paintings to worry about. But, uh, the B button, this is his secondary attack. Oh. Okay, uh, so the Tiki's will actually like, go track people down and blow up. Let's see if we can... They follow us, and then, like you see with the sheep there, so... That's actually pretty cool. Uh, but I think Double Trouble will be a pretty good character. Uh, yeah, I'm interested to play with him more. What I will do now, I think, is just in this here, uh, part 63, I'll edit this in with the RAN on Activision. It'll be fairly short that way for you. And uh, I'll come back. I've got some pretty cool stuff coming. So, uh, Questions, comments, feel free to ask here on YouTube or the blog, oneofwisdom.blogspot.com. You can follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook, whichever you prefer. And as always, thanks for watching.